Welcome, everyone. Today, we're delving into the world of AWS Container Orchestration with a focus on ECS. Specifically, we'll be comparing AWS ECS on EC2 and Fargate. Let's kick things off with a brief introduction to AWS ECS. Amazon Elastic Container Service, or ECS, is a powerful container management service provided by AWS. It simplifies the deployment and scaling of containerized applications. ECS offers two launch types, EC2 and Fargate. Before we dive into the comparison, let's understand these launch types. With EC2, you have control over your instances, offering flexibility and customization. You can choose the instance type, size, and configure the environment to meet your specific needs. This gives you more control but also requires more management. Fargate, on the other hand, abstracts away the infrastructure. It allows you to run containers without managing the underlying EC2 instances. This provides a serverless experience, simplifying operations and allowing you to focus solely on your applications. Let's explore the ideal scenarios for using AWS ECS on EC2. If you have specific infrastructure requirements or need granular control over your environment, ECS on EC2 might be your choice. For example, if your application relies on specialized hardware or requires specific networking configurations, ECS on EC2 allows you to tailor the environment to meet these demands. Now, let's shift our focus to Fargate and its use cases. Fargate is perfect for those who prioritize simplicity and cost efficiency. This makes it an excellent choice for scenarios where you want to deploy applications quickly, without worrying about the underlying infrastructure. Time to compare performance between AWS ECS on EC2 and Fargate. While EC2 offers customization, Fargate provides a more managed, serverless experience. The performance difference is often negligible for many workloads. However, if your application requires fine-tuning of the underlying infrastructure, ECS on EC2 might be preferred. Now, the million-dollar question, how do you choose the right option for your workloads? It all boils down to your specific needs. Consider factors like control, simplicity, and cost when making this decision. If you need full control over your instances and have specific infrastructure requirements, ECS on EC2 might be the way to go. On the other hand, if simplicity and cost efficiency are your priorities, Fargate could be the better choice. Before we conclude, let's discuss some best practices for AWS ECS. Whether you opt for EC2 or Fargate, following these best practices will optimize your containerized applications on ECS. Properly configure your container images, use task definitions effectively, and leverage ECS features like service discovery and load balancing for seamless operation. As we wrap up our exploration of AWS ECS on EC2 versus Fargate, remember that the right choice depends on your unique requirements. Feel free to explore more on AWS documentation for in-depth insights. Thank you for joining us today. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, happy cloud computing.